G'day guys and welcome back to another video on the Chalkstar channel and today I'll be doing my round 16 AFL tips so I've been away for a couple of weeks now I think the last time I did it was round 12 maybe yeah I think that was my last video but round 13 14 and 15 I was a very I was very busy so I had no time to record but I did go to the Bulldogs Hawthorne game so the match day vlog will be coming out I think on Friday potentially so stay tuned for that but yeah we're back we'll continue on for the last few rounds of the year we're coming to a close it's been incredibly fast but yeah let's just appreciate what we have left of this season and thursday night thursday night game this will be an amazing game to watch 720 brisbane lions take on the western bulldogs at the gabba now i saw the bulldogs closely on uh, last last friday at at marvel stadium and they are they are really they're a really strong team so at Brisbane though, they did lose to Melbourne by a lot, but I reckon it's at the Gabba. And since the Dogs did get ahead of them in the prelim last year, I think Brisbane will want to come back from that. So I'll go Brisbane by around eight. And yeah, I reckon Brisbane should win this game. So to prove that themselves, to prove that they are, they are pretty premiership contenders. And the Dogs, this is a must-win game if they want to have... A very high chance of making the A. They probably will. But winning this game would increase their chances a lot. So, yeah, I'll take Brisbane in this one. Friday night, Carlton versus St. Kilda. You, you never know. I reckon Carlton will win this one. But St. Kilda, they've got a chance. Um, they've been pretty bad for the last couple of weeks. And these two teams are both. They're on the rise, but have been fairly inconsistent. But I'll go, I'll go with a safe option. I'll go with Carlton for this one. Saturday morning it's saturday afternoon i should say the bombers taking on the swans this could be another game that essen will lose by a lot I, I i can't see a scenario where they win they do have these random random occasions where they can you know win a game here and there with hawthorne and st kilda but i i don't think sydney will drop this game it's a must win their position in the eight is in doubt realistically but yeah i reckon they'll get this one done Adelaide versus Melbourne. Last time they met here, Adelaide got Melbourne their first loss. But I don't think Melbourne will lose this one. It's 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 a fairly easy game for them. But if they want to retain first place, they would have to win this game. So I'm back in the Ds. Cats versus North Melbourne. Ooh, boy. This is look at the odds. Nineteen dollars. If North somehow win this, this would be up to the year. Geelong won't drop this. It's at GMHBA. I can't see a scenario where North win. So. I'll go with Geelong in this one, and what a game this will be. The Gold Coast Suns taking on the Collingwood Magpies at Metricon. This is a 50-50 game. The, the Suns, they've been playing some good footy, but so have the Pies. I'll back in the Pies for this one. Uh, what they've been playing, the way they've been playing, it's it's really nice to watch. And the Suns, I don't think it's the year. Uh, I reckon they'll make the eight next year, but... Yeah, it's, it's really, really hard. Everything almost has to go their way for them to make the 8 this year. And I reckon Collingwood winning this game would almost lock this spot in the 8. So, I'll back in the pies. Sunday, Arvo. Richmond taking on the Eagles at the MCG. you got to go with the, Eagles, uh, the, the Richmond Tigers for this one. The odds are $6.70. So, yeah. I'll, Richmond, they need to win this game if they want to make the 8. It's, a lot, it's, it's the same case for a lot of the teams. But, yeah. Richmond, I reckon they will make it, but they just have to win games like these. And then GWS taking on the Hawks. Normally, I would back in the Hawks, but oh, I don't know. The Giants, they came back in that last quarter against Collingwood, and they've been playing some alright footy under their new coach, or caretaker coach. But yeah, the Hawks, they've been competitive for a lot of games, but maybe like one to two quarters we might drop off, and that's the game, so... Hawks, the game style stacks up against the good teams, but I don't think we can play it consistently. We're a young side, so it takes time, but I'll tip Giants for this one. But I could see Hawthorne winning potentially with Jack Gunston, I think, hopefully back. And maybe Josh Ward back in this side. So, yeah, I'll tip Giants for this one. But could be any anyone's game. And then last game, Frio taking on the Port Adelaide Power. So, it's not up to stadium. Port have been playing some more right footy. Still are a chance to make the eight, but I reckon Freo they won't they won't lose two weeks in a row. Hopefully, I mean they did lose to 
Go Kirsten. Who was it? I think it was Go Kirsten. So we'll go back. We'll, we'll go back and check it. I completely lost track. Oh yeah, it was free. It was Go Kirsten Collingwood. So they could lose this one, but it's against Port. I can't see Freer losing two in a row, especially against Port. So I'll go with Freer, and that's my round. 16 AFL tips. And for the margin comp, we'll go with Thursday nights. Brisbane taking on the Bulldogs. It, it's probably a game of the round. Yeah, really excited for this game. So that's about it for the round 16 tips. If you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe. And yeah, see you guys next video. Bye.